Hello everyone and welcome to RS Learning. In this video we will start with a new topic of history which is important dates and congress sessions of the chapter nationalism in India. I have come across many students who face issue in this topic so here we are to make it easy for you. Starting with the dates topic let's see first that when did the first world war or world war 1 happen. It started in 1914 and ended in 1918. So from 1914 to 1918. Then comes the famine or the crop failures. It occurred twice in our country. First in 1918 to 1919 and then from 1920 to 1921. Agar yaad ho, this was accompanied by influenza epidemic. This ke accordingly 12 to 13 million people died in a country. Then Gandhiji returned to our country to India in January 1915 with his concept of Satyagraha. After that for 3 years he did Satyagraha in different places in our country. In 1916, he did his first Satyagraha in Champaran Bihar. Second, in the Khera district of Gujarat in 1917. And last, in 1918 in Ahmedabad for the cotton mill workers. So, three Satyagraha were 1916 in Champaran, 1917 in Khera district, and 1918 in Ahmedabad for the cotton mill workers. Then, in 1919 came the Rowlet Act. What was the Rowlet Act? According to which, Anyone can be put in prison for two years without a trial in the court. After this came the Jallianwala Bagh massacre on 13th April 1919 on the day of Besaki, in which hundreds and hundreds of people died in our country. Then in March 1919 the Khilafat Committee was formed by Ali brothers in Bombay, Ali brothers Shaukat Ali and Muhammad Ali. Then comes the establishment of Aud Kisan Sabha. Aut Kisan Sabha was formed in October 1920 which was headed by Baba Ramchandra and Jawaharlal Nehru. Its main purpose was to look at the grievances of the peasants of Awadh who were disturbed by the high rents of talukdars and the landlords. So Aut Kisan Sabha in October 1920. Then in December 1920 the Khilafat movement was adopted and collaborated with the non-cooperation movement. For 4 months, 4 months ke liye Gandhi ji ko pohat mashakkat karni padi thi. It was way too difficult for him to convince the other members of the Congress. But finally, in December 1920, he succeeded in doing so. Then after a month only, that is January 1921, the movement was officially started. Kya thi movement? Kya expect tha? Ye sab hum karenge but in another video. Iske liye aapke liye hum alag video laenge. For now, let's just concentrate on the dates. So when was the movement started? The movement was officially started in January 1921. So January 1921 was start hui and khatam kab hui? Khatam hui ek saal and ek mahine. One year and one month baad. That was February 1922. So start hui non-cooperation Khilafat movement in January 1921 and it ended in February 1922. Ab reason kya tha khatam Gandhi ji withdrawal the movement because of the famous incident of Chauri Chaura where a peaceful procession turned into a violent mob jahan pe police ne bahut brutally log ko mara tha bahut log mare gaye the and in response Indians ne bhi kaafi British officers ko mara tha so after this Gandhi ji thought that the Satyagrahis need to first be trained iske liye unne withdraw kar li then in 1924 there was the execution of Aluri Sitaram Raju. Who was Aluri Sitaram Raju? He was the leader of rebels of the Gudam Hills of Andhra Pradesh. And he also claimed that he has some supernatural powers with him. With him ended a two year armed rebellion against the Britishers. So he was executed in 1924. Then in 1928 came the Simon Commission. So Simon Commission arrived in India in 1928, which was greeted by the slogan Simon Go Back. Then, in October 1929, the dominion status was offered to India by Lord Evan. Lord Evan ne hume dominion status offer kiya tha for an unspecified future. Ki kabhi hum future mein aapko a dominion status denge. This was in October 1929. Then, after a few months, in December 1929, Congress formulated the demand of Poon Swaraj, Poon Swaraj ya fir complete independence that now we don't want any dominion status in fact we want complete independence. This was done in the Lahore Congress session and in the same session it was decided that 26 January 1930 I repeat the date 26 January 1930 will be celebrated as the independence day on which 
every individual will take a pledge for india's independence but 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 when gandhi observed that this attracted very little attention he decided to do that to which people can relate themselves to so he wrote a letter to lord evin citing 11 demands on 31st january 1930 31st january 1930 ko gandhi ji ne letter likha lord evin ko and the ultimatum given was 11th march but when gandhi ji saw ki lord evin taraf se koi response nahi aa raha he is not reacting to it so on 12th march 1930 the next day of his ultimatum he started his dandi march he started his dandi march from sabarmati ashram to the dandi coast so dandi march kab start hui 12th march 1930 he traveled for 24 days from sabarmati ashram to the dandi coast and reached there on 6th april 1930 kitne kitne kis date pe pahuncha 6th april 1930 ko gandhi ji reached dandi and broke the famous salt law and started off with his movement that was the civil disobedience movement so 12th march 1930 ko dandi march start kari thi and 6th april 1930 ko he reached dandi and started the civil disobedience movement by breaking the salt law but again by 5th march 1931 he again decided to call off the movement kya date thi 5th march 1931 so start the movement 6th april 1930 and ended on 5th march 1931 again sir for sir ek saal chal pa ye movement after this gandhi decided to sign the gandhi even pact or come in a contract with britishers which was gandhi even pact and call of the movement and also agreed that he will attend the second round table conference in london let me remind you first round table conference mein koi bhi nahi gaya tha it was boycotted all together so second round table conference mein gandhi jaane ko taiyar ho gaye so in december 1931 came the second round table conference in which gandhi ji went to london to attend it so after this let's talk about the two business organization formed in india before independence do aise organization thi jo business minded log ke liye thi for the growing of business one was the indian industrial and commercial congress it was formed in 1920 and the second is fiki आई एम श्योर काफ़ी लोगों ने इसके ऑफिस भी देखे होंगे डेली में भी काफ़ी इसके ऑफिस हैं सो सेकेंड इज़ फिकी वॉट इज़ फिकी फिकी इज फेडरेशन ऑफ इंडियन चेंबर ऑफ कॉमर्स एंड इंडस्ट्रीज इट वॉज फॉर्म इन नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी सेवन देन लेट्स टॉक अबाउट द ऑर्गनाइजेशन ऑफ द बैकवर्ड कमिटीज इन द डिप्रेस क्लास एसोसिएशन वॉट वॉज दिस दिस वॉज एन एसोसिएशन बाई बी आर अम्बेडकर और भीम राव अम्बेडकर फॉर द बेटरमेंट ऑफ द बैकवर्ड क्लास सो दैट दे कैन कम टूगेदर एंड फाइट फॉर द इक्वालिटी This was done in 1930. When Gandhi ji saw that Bhim Rao Ambedkar is asking for reserved seats for the backward communities, he started a fast on to death because he thought iski wajah se jo unity ban rahi hai bahut mushkil samay country mein that will break off. So he started a fast on to death and the result the result was the Pune Pact. Kab hua Pune Pact? Pune Pact happened in September 1932. so the organization of dalits into depressed class association that was done in 1930 seeing which gandhi decided his past on to that on to death and the result was pune pact pune pact of september 1932 jaldi se revise karna do teen cheeze dandi march started on 12th march 1930 6th april ko khat- uh, civil disobedience movement start hui and 5th ko 5th march 1931 ko movement khatam ho gayi Now coming to the Congress sessions, इसमें हम मेनली तीन कॉमर्स सेशन की बात करेंगे द फर्स्ट सेशन इज कॉलकटा सेशन कॉलकटा सेशन से इन दिस गांधी जी कन्विंस द अदर अदर लीडर्स टू स्टार्ट द खिलाफत मूवमेंट अलॉन्ग विद द नॉन कॉपरेशन मूवमेंट पहले नॉन कॉपरेशन का मेन एम था ओन एन ओनली स्वराज बट नाउ ही कन्विंस दैट नॉन कॉपरेशन शुड बी स्टार्टेड फॉर स्वराज एज वेल एज फॉर खिलाफत वॉट वॉज द एम बेसिकली एम था ताकि हिंदूज एंड मुस्लिम यूनाइट हो सके सेकेंड वॉज द नागपुर सेशन ऑफ दिप्टफ दिसंबर नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी नागपुर सेशन कब हुआ दिसंबर नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी इन विच फाइनली द नॉन कॉपरेशन मूवमेंट वॉज एडॉप्टेड एंड फ्रॉम द नेक्स्ट मंथ ओनली फ्रॉम जनवरी नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी वन इट वॉज स्टार्टेड सो सेप्टेंबर नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी में कैलकटा सेशन हुआ जिसमें गांधी जी एडवाइज की शुरू करते हैं इन नागपुर इट वॉज फाइनली एडॉप्टेड इन लाहौर सेशन ऑफ दिसंबर 
1929 lahore session december 1929 अंडर द प्रेजिडेंसी ऑफ जवाहरलाल नेहरू जवाहरलाल नेहरू जो हमारे फर्स्ट प्राइम मिनिस्टर भी थे द कांग्रेस फाइट इंडिपेंडेंस एंड ऑल्सो डिसाइडेड दैट ट्वेंटी सिक्स जनवरी नाइनटीन थर्टी विल बी सेलिब्रेटेड एज आ इंडिपेंडेंस डे इंडिपेंडेंस डे सो तीन सेशन कोलकाता नागपुर एंड लाहौर सो दैट्स ऑल फॉर दिस वीडियो जल्दी से रिवाइज करते हैं सेप्टेम्बर नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी दिसंबर नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी एंड दिसंबर नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी नाइन कोलकाता सेशन नागपुर सेशन एंड लाहौर सेशन सो थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो अगर दोबारा रिवाइज करना हो यू कैन वॉच इट अगेन एज मेनी टाइम एज यू वॉन्ट एंड डू सब सच वीडियोज एंड इफ यू हैव एनी कमेंट्स फॉर एस एनी सजेशन फॉर एस दैन डू राइट इन द कमेंट सेक्शन बिलो थैंक्स लॉट स्टूडेंट्स थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग दिस